right, Chaos, talk. Who gave you the money to do all this? Butter, wake up! I think he's dead, dude. He's not dead. <laughs> uh, fellas, I think we better get him back to base. All right, come on. Let's take him to the holding cell. The holding cell? Oh, jeez, it, it's kind of late, fellas. I should get home or I'm gonna be grounded. You should have thought of that before you tried to lava the town, Chaos. Hey, dude. It was great working with you again, man. It was like old times. Yeah, well, I told you. This was a one-shot deal. I only helped out because I owed the new kid a favor. Come on, Shed. Come back to the team. Can't do that, Kite. Freedom Pals is gonna make way more money with their franchise. You're wrong. We're gonna make like a billion dollars. We're gonna make like a zillion dollars. But guys, <laughs> think about it. Why would someone pay Butters to cause more chaos? Who could it be? Maybe it's that Tommy Nelson kid. He's always been kind of a dick. Oh, have a seat, Thunderpants. What if the person paying Butters wasn't a kid? I is that it, Chaos? Were you paid by an adult? I'm telling you, I don't know his name, fellas. Nobody does. He's just trying to unite all the crime families in town. He's everywhere. He's nameless, faceless. He can change his appearance like the wind changes direction. Wait, what did you say? He says there's a revolution coming, and the darkness of our own hearts will bring about our undoing. Oh my god. He, he is that which liberates, and he knows the true weakness of tolerance, and his coming will bring about a tide of chaos like nothing we've never seen, you betcha. Oh my god. Could it be? No, it's impossible. What's impossible? There's only one person I know of who can disguise himself so easily, and it's the same person who might have a motive for tearing South Park apart. Who? Oh. Mitch Connor. Mitch Connor? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Who's Mitch Connor? It's Carbon's dumbass hand puppet. You know damn well that Connor was just using my hand to suit his needs. At first, he disguised himself as Jennifer Lopez, who loves tacos and burritos. When his cover was blown, he was arrested by the police, but escaped. But why would he want to take down South Park? And where would he get all his money? Shut up! It's not Mitch stupid fucking Connor! How do you know? No, Kyle is right, you guys. It couldn't be Mitch Connor. Connor died in an oil rig explosion in northern Alaska. Fuck this, I'm going to bed. Yes, yes, good idea, humankind. Everyone get back to your homes, it's getting late. Let's all reconvene tomorrow. After... Ski... And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park! The South Park vigilante struck again last night, this time at a meth lab in the downtown u store facility. Here with more is a midget in a fedora. Tom, six people were arrested last night after the vigilante exposed a huge meth lab in the storage facility behind me. Eyewitnesses have come forward with shocking reports that the vigilante's farts were so awful they seemed to actually rip the fabric of time. You ain't never heard a fart like this, man. It was like one minute he farted on my dick and the next thing my dick was like 20 seconds in the past. Finally, someone is standing up to all the crime in this city. If you ask me, these people here all deserve to be farted on. He's a menace if you ask me. How long before this vigilante gets radical and blows up a school or a church, huh? How long before Captain America becomes Captain Ideology? Huh? The third Captain America movie? How long was that? About six years? About six years! Dozens of protesters gathered outside the police station today as a warrant was issued for the vigilante's arrest. This city will not be victimized by mass crusaders who sneak around and fart on people at night. We urge all citizens to arm themselves and fight against this kind of rectal oppression. <sighs> yeah, it's me. Nobody knows anything about this kid. Not what race he is, not even if it's a boy or a girl. What do we do, sir? Just keep getting the product into people's drugs and alcohol. I'll handle the vigilante. This deal's getting out of control. You said you could get the mayor out of office. You wanted to be left alone, Commissioner. To do what you love doing. I've made that happen. Just stay calm and soon everyone will have exactly what they want. Hey kid, wait up! You are the new kid, right? My name's Wendy. Nice to have you at our school. That little problem Call Girl told you about? It's a lot worse. The Chamber of Commerce wants to get rid of the vigilante no matter what it takes. You know the bathrooms in the park? Call Girl wants you to meet her there. 
right now. Yeah, anyway, nice to have you in town, new kid. 